The value that young people would like to see is that they vote and what they vote for happens tomorrow. That they could see change immediately in their lives. I think that's what young people would like to see in politics. It's just a, it's a hard thing. That doesn't, that doesn't happen a lot. Sometimes you're in a political struggle for decades before you see the change uh, that you want. So I think that young people have to think of voting and electoral politics as one tool in their arsenal. I think you should be involved in grassroots activism. I don't think that electoral politics is the end all, be all. It's just one tool in your arsenal. It's, it's something that you have to do because if you don't do it, your resources, the taxes you're paying at the gas pump, the taxes you're paying when you go to the grocery store, the taxes you're paying if you're filing income taxes are going to somebody else's agenda. And that's the, that's the most simplest way uh, uh, you can put it. I remember once I saw an interview with Gil Scott Heron and the Village Voice, and someone asked him, was he political? And his answer was, if you pay taxes, you're supporting the political machine, so you're political. So the, the question is, are the resources going to go for something that you want and something that your community needs, or are they going to go to someone else's agenda?